Okay, cool. So now, why don't we go on ahead and work on <gasps> my bedroom? Hey everybody and welcome to another Roblox adventure. Today we are back with the plaza and this game, now let me tell you, this game is one of the most gorgeous games in Roblox and so with that being said, wouldn't you think you need one of the most gorgeous condos? And one of the most gorgeous games in Roblox, I think so. So what we're going to be doing today, and some of you guys were asking for this, is to do a plaza condo special where we we make our condo picture perfect. And so last time we we you know we were working on the condo a little bit, and it was good, but it wasn't what it could have been. It wasn't everything that you know it, it it was truly made out to be and so my friend alex and i'm sure a lot of you know him he has a condo in the plaza and i am very jealous of it whenever i saw it i was like you know that's a pretty good looking condo so you know what i want my own condo i want my own condo to look good so we're over here at mix hardware and we are going to start buying everything we need to truly make this condo perfect at least perfect for us i think we're gonna go on ahead to the paints catalog and we're gonna take a look at the different paints for a room. Let's take a look here. So this is paint. I think this is what I need. So we're gonna go ahead and do this one. Uh, so we got Lily White. And then if we go back, I think there's materials that we can get for the floor. Okay, so um, over here, hopefully this is meant for the floor. I think it is. So you know what, these actually, just the normal wood is like a very subtle wood and I like it. So we're gonna go ahead and actually get that. I don't think I need like baseboards or anything like that, do I? I don't know, I don't think so. Let's actually see, what are my baseboards like? So I got, hmm, what kind of baseboards would you have for a white wall? You know what, we'll figure it out. If we ever need to come back here, then we'll go ahead and do that. All right, um, blender, we'll definitely need a blender for uh, the kitchen. Um, here we go, let's get some furniture and let's see what uh, Marika has to offer. So we're gonna want a bunch of stuff. There's a couple of these things that we actually already have. Ooh, let's get the dome light actually. Let's get one of those. Okay, and then the dresser we'll probably need for the bedroom. Ooh, I like those kinds of lamps actually. Let's go ahead and get one of those. Ooh, an oval table though. That would go very well. If we're going for class, that would go very, very well indeed. Oh, the bath, definitely need the bath, of course, for uh, the bathroom. And then the circle mirror. You know, let's get, let's get a circle mirror. We can put that at the front where you first enter. Let's get one of those rugs too. I'm having a lot of time just buying a bunch of random stuff. This is gonna be good. Oh, modern bookshelf, yes please. Modern lamp, of course. Gotta get everything modern. We're definitely gonna need a toilet, that's for sure. Nightstand, ooh, I think I'll need that for my, for my bedroom. Yeah, 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 I'm gonna need one of those. Towel rack for the bathroom, of course. And, ooh, wow, there's so much furniture. I actually didn't realize there was this much stuff. Oh, let's get a bonsai tree. Yes, those look so good. Okay, perfect. Um, a pool table. Oh, yes. Oh, let's get a pool table. Yes, please. And then I think we're actually doing pretty good. I think we're gonna be fine. Let's also get a glass bowl and a glass cup just to add. Look at two glass cups just to add to the um, like to the table and stuff. You know, give things a little bit more of an actual like existence reason. Give things more reason. You know. Okay, then we got serious desk and stuff. Man, we got a bunch of stuff here. Okay, this is good. We're gonna want to go to the electronics store so that we can get. Um, more stuff for our uh, for our like computer area and whatnot. Okay, here we go. Electronics. I would like another monitor. That's what I want. <gasps> Man, they got spotlight as well. Let me see what all this stuff looks like. Ooh. Okay. Yeah. This this is some good stuff. And then oh oh, we're definitely gonna need this. We're gonna need the stereo. And then we're gonna need to put. Oh, we can have a fog machine too. That is awesome. Okay. Cool. Hello, owner of Dan's Electronics. I would like to buy some electronics, please. Okay. Uh, let's get two computer monitors. That's what we need. Two computer monitors. We can get a flat screen TV. Absolutely. Uh, meaning we're going to want like a TV stand for it. I'm not too sure if we might need to go back to the furniture store and get a TV stand. Oh, whoa. 
We can get a train set. Oh, we can get a train set and put it in one of the rooms. It'd be our dedicated train room. That would be crazy. Um, oh, I'm tempted. It's very, very tempting indeed. Ooh, do I want the train set? Yes, I do. I want the train set. We're getting the train set. Of course we are. Cool. And we might as well get the stereo as well it's because there is a chance I can put the TV in between it. But... I do kind of want like a nice looking TV stand too. Hmm. I guess, fine. We'll quickly go back to the plaza decor. We'll try to do this very quickly. Whoa, I just realized the furniture changes when you come in here. Oh, that is so cool. So you can see different stuff every time. Oh, that is awesome. See how much easier it is to see things now, now that it's not nighttime outside. It's crazy. See, the coffee table could technically be a TV stand, technically. Oh, triple LED light to put over the TV. That's usually where those go. That would be very good. Let's go ahead and get one of those. And you know, what? let's get the storage table because that kind of looks like a TV stand. So that would actually work quite well. Okay, so you know, what? we're going to roll with what we have here and we're going to see what we can do with it. Here we go. Let's go back to the condo now and actually put all of this to use. I'm pretty excited, but I have a feeling that I am missing a bunch of stuff and I'll need to figure that out once I'm in the condo. Okay, so far things seem to be going pretty okay. Um, we did lose a lot of money. <laughs> we spent a lot of money today, uh, but that is okay. If, if it is for the sake of our condo, then I am more than willing to be spending this much money. Okay. Um, what was it? What was that? What was I doing? Right. We. I. What the one thing that I am concerned about is. Um, I remember there being issues with the um, the floor and then the wallpaper. So I wasn't entirely too sure how to do that properly, but this time we will, we now actually have time. We're, we're setting a lot of time to just put towards the condo and make this condo good. So we're going with a nice and normal condo. We don't need no super condo or anything like that. Okay, here we go. Let us go on ahead up to, oh, was that the fifth floor? Oh, I don't remember. I think it was the fifth floor and I was over here somewhere. Is that mine? Oh, yes, it is. 504. Okay, here we go. All right. Oh, I'm excited. Here we go. I just hope everything goes well. Okay. So first off, TV. Ooh, should the TV go here? Because there's less space here for the couch and more space here. Oh, yes, I think so. I think the couch should go here. Okay, here's what we're gonna do then. First off, let's figure out, let's figure out the paint actually. Floor, let's first try the floor. So let's go, this is the living room, floor, main. Okay, so these are the different colors we have and then the different materials, I see. So we can make it wood and then we have to select a color, I see now, okay. We're gonna need to go back and get a beige color for the wood, but that is okay. Right now, this is already a decent start. And now the base, see what goes with, what goes with a white, a white wall and then a baseboard. Cause if it's, if it's gonna be a beige floor, I'm assuming you just do a beige baseboard and that's probably what we're gonna need. Okay, so the baseboard is also gonna be wood. Yes, yes, there we go. Wow, this actually looks pretty good already. Okay, so we want all the floors, floor entry, all of it to be wood. Okay, very good. And then the top and the walls are going to be white. Perfect. Okay, this is all right so far. We're gonna start with this. Uh, we're gonna have to change the color later and then the patio is probably gonna be a different material. Probably wanna make the patio like a nice carpet or something. Ooh, that'd be good. So this is where the TV is gonna go. Let's do customize and put down that, um, that thingy, that thingy that we got. What was the thingy that I'm talking about? I am talking about the small storage table. Here we go. Let's see if this, if the TV would look good on this because there's a very good chance that it just like absolutely won't. Did I put it backwards this time? No, I think I actually did it right. Okay, good. I did it right. This is good. Um, and now let's put the flat screen down. Can I put it on the storage table? Oh, yes I can. Yes, I can. Okay, bam. Oh, wow, look at that. That actually looks pretty good. Hey, you know what? I'm pretty happy with that. That's not too bad. We can even put like a little plant there or something. We do have a bonsai tree. How big is this? Oh, this is very tiny. No, this is something you would put. This is something you would put on like a, uh, a table or something. So, uh, but if we do the potted plant, which is up here, it can actually go quite nicely right here. So we don't want to get it in the way of the TV though. Um, 
that kind of works just like that i suppose oh wait i actually had a good angle there um it's kind of shoved in the corner oh uh, you know what? that's all right that's not too bad you know there's the potted plant there's the tv it's looking pretty okay um and then over top of the tv is where we are going to put the um the thingy, the uh, the the lights, the LED lights. That is the whole purpose. I got those LED lights to even begin with because those usually go over a TV like this. Um, yes, because it's supposed to give like a little bit of backlighting, I believe, uh, so that you can see like the back of the TV and stuff. And then it's also just uh, if you don't want it to be pitch black when you're watching TV. I think it's something like that. I think that's usually how that goes. I'm not entirely sure. Anyways, very very small details there. Um, okay, and now for where we are going to put our couch. So we had already the leather sectional right here. There we go. It would have been perfect if it was like that. Oh, that would have been so perfect. Oh, it would have gone perfectly there. Hmm. Should we swap this around? I think we should because then that way, if we... Oh, okay, I've got an idea. So if we swap this around, I need to... Wait, how do I... Okay, hold on. Save and then... Oh, no. Here we go. Okay. Uh, what am I doing? Customize. Let's, uh, let's, let's take these off. How am I? It's not, there we go. We're gonna put the leather sectional here because it fits quite perfectly. Eh, eh. There we go. Okay. So that's where that goes. Ooh, it's just slightly too much to the side. I can't deal with it. I can't deal with it. I gotta, I gotta make sure it's perfect. Eh. And, eh. oh, there we go. And is it perfect? Yes, it is perfect. Okay, good. And then what we can do is put, oh, we can put this over top, something like that. Oh, I didn't know people were just allowed in my condo. Okay, well, I didn't really change anything there. Hello, Cat Catalina, Catalina Millen, Millen, Mil Catalina Millen, one, two, three. Good day. We need to put down the glass table. Um... Where was that? Where did I have that? I know I had a glass coffee table. Oval table. Here we go. This is where, this is what I wanted. So just like, yeah, yeah, that's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, thank you, Catalina. Thank you. Very nice of you. And then this is where we put, oh, no, this is not where we would put a plant because over here is where we're going to be putting our stuff. Okay. Uh, yes, like this. There we go. So we gotta we wanna make sure we match it up nicely. So it'd probably be like this. There we go. Bam. And then this is where I put the flat screen TV. Please tell me I can put it there. No, I can't put it there. That was the one thing I wanted. Oh man. Okay, well, looks like we're gonna have to go back to the small storage table, which again in turn does still work. There we go. Bam. Alright. And then we put the flat screen right on top. Boop. Oh man, there you go. All right, looking good. I am happy with this. And then we can put the modern shelf right beside it. Where's the shelf? Modern bookshelf. Oh no, I don't think I'm gonna be able to fit it. Oh, I'm not gonna be able to fit it. I'm not gonna be able to fit it beside my TV. Oh no, where else am I supposed to put this? Ooh, right here? Ooh, I could put it right here. That's not too bad. Um. Why not? So let's go ahead and put that down. And then, oh, what if I put the bonsai tree on there? Wow, what? Wow, man. We're going to put the bonsai tree onto the shelf. Oh, this is going to be crazy. Should I put it in the middle? No, I should put it to the side like that. Ooh, classy, classy. Look at that. Um, I feel like I could have put it more this way, actually. I am kind of a perfectionist, not going to lie. <laughs> All right, here we go. Perfect. See, that doesn't look too bad. It's like you're walking along. Oh, fancy. Okay, very good. And then here, I feel like there could be more stuff going on in here. If there's any way I could have put like, hmm, if I could put something on the wall, that would have been nice. Oh, well, let us go on to, oh, 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 actually, we got to put this carpet down. Oh, man. How should we put the carpet, though? We kind of want to put it like in front like this, don't we? Yeah, kind of like that. Hey, that looks pretty good. Hey, I'm pretty okay with this actually. I kind of like it. Okay, and if we go into the bathroom, bathroom's gonna need some tile flooring for sure. And then it's probably gonna need a countertop with a sink and stuff. Didn't really think about that. But in the meantime, we could actually just put down the bathtub uh, like so. Boop, there we go. There's the bathtub. And then we need to put down the toilet. 
Oh, and we're gonna need to put down a mirror, and the mirror's probably gonna go in front of where there would be a thingy. Um, a thing by a thingy, I mean a countertop. But all these countertops that we have right now, we gotta reserve for the kitchen. So what we're gonna be doing here is uh, pretending like the countertop is there, and then later we will actually be putting the stuff in. Okay, circular mirror is going to go. Wait, how, how do I make sure that this is, is the mirror facing the right way? I can't really tell. This, there we go. I can't tell if that mirror is facing the right way. It's too dark. Um, I'm not too sure. Okay, anyways, let's us put down the toilet, which will go right here. How does this sound? Right here, and then we could even put, oh, and then when you put, oh, I got an idea. Okay, so we'll put the toilet right here, like so. Wait, like this? Or should we do it? Oh, because we should do it alongside with... Yes. We should do it alongside with where the counters are going to be. And then this way right here is where I'm going to put... Wait for it. Wait for it. Where is it? I can't find it. Um, this is where I'm going to put the... <gasps> towel rack! There we go. Oh, man. Now we got the nice little towel rack right there. You know, this bathroom's gonna be all right. You know, it's gonna be fine. It's nothing special. We can even put a little light here somewhere. The bucket light in here. How does that sound? Ooh, it's, it's not very bright at all. Um, maybe a bucket light doesn't belong in the bathroom, but what will belong out here? Oh, whoa, that is a big light. Okay, what will belong out here? Oh, I forgot that's not supposed to be there anymore. We need to put those, those lights. See, look, now that it's dark, you guys will actually get a look of, at what I kind of meant by uh, those triple LED lights. There we go, just like that. How does that look? Um, can't really tell, it doesn't really do anything. Well, never mind. Anyways, wow, look at this view. Look how good that is. Oh man, I am very, very happy with this condo so far, I gotta say. And then once we actually have the proper colors, ooh, goodness me. Actually, speaking of which, I need to, um, I need to paint the walls. I didn't really like touch that at all because I'm pretty sure I have the correct color for them. Let's go living room and then walls. And then we got to give it white. There we go. There we go. See, that's what I needed. So that already. Now just imagine if we had a beige floor, how good that would look. Oh man, I really want that beige floor now. But we just got to, we got to make sure everything's perfect. This condo is looking way better than it did before. Let me know if you guys agree. I think it looks better. Here, you know, and that actually that's a good place to put the potted plant. So it's going to look real nice, real nice, just like so. There we go. How does that look? It's looking pretty all right, you know? I'm liking it. I'm liking it. I can dig it. Okay, cool. So let's go ahead and take a look at the kitchen here. Um, lighting is pretty good in this room, so let's actually do a dome light over here. What do we need here? So we need the kitchen counters, okay, uh, like this. My kitchen was actually pretty okay already. I didn't really have to change it, but that's okay. Uh, kitchen counter, again, another one right there, just like that. And then we can put the kitchen cabinet above one of the things, probably like right Ooh, actually wait, because we'll do, oh, actually wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. We got to put the kitchen sink in the middle here. There you go. And then we put the kitchen cabinet on, there we go, on this side like that. And then when we put the other kitchen counter like so, and then we put the fridge, bam. Wait, hold on, I need to make sure it's rotated properly. Just like that, bam. Oh man, this is a nice looking kitchen. I'm liking this kitchen, guys. Oh, if we could put a little plant somewhere. Oh, 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 At like I was saying, like I was saying, remember when I, um, remember whenever I got those cups and whatnot, like little decor? Well, I'll show you exactly why I did. Because, bam, look at that. Now, a little glass in the kitchen, it adds atmosphere. That's it, you see? You see how much that adds? Now it's like the kitchen has a little cup. We can put another cup like right here. You see, it's like just little, you know, it's just like little, little, little things, you know, little things just kind of lying around. And then we can even put the bowl like up top here or something. Or actually maybe it'd be better to put, well, hmm, would the bowl go nicely up there? Eh, eh. I'm, I'm not digging it, you know, I'm not like fully feeling it. So it's okay, you know, we'll stick with this for now. So it's okay. Um, we can actually put a rug in the kitchen. 
Is that okay? Is that okay to put rugs in the kitchen? I think so. I think if you do it like nicely, like like this. Hey, you know, that looks pretty good. You know what? I like it. I like it. I'm happy with it. So yeah, it's pretty good. Unless we want to put that. Is there a better place to put that rug? I feel like there is. Hmm. Well, it's okay. The, the rug fits in the kitchen quite nicely right now. We're going to stick with that. And then let's do... This is actually a good place to put the pool table. Let's put a light somewhere. So if we can get a nice light. Um, okay, here, let's put the pool table down. Oh man, this is gonna look good. Okay, let's go like this. Actually, is this a good place to put a pool table? I'm not entirely too sure. Um, Cause you need a, if you're actually playing pool, you're gonna need a decent amount of room. So this would be pretty good, just like that. Hey, you know, it's not too bad. It's all right, you know? Yeah, yeah, you know what, I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it, nice little pool table action. This is where we could have like a little, oh, if we had stools for the bar right here, oh man, okay. And we can even put a little lamp somewhere here. Uh, little half dome lamp there. There you go, how does that look? Maybe it's actually better up here. Let's put it right there, there you go. There you go, nice little lamp. Is that a good place to put it? I'm not too sure. Hmm, it should be fine. Yeah, you know what, that looks pretty good. I like it, okay, cool. So now, why don't we go on ahead and work on <gasps> my bedroom. Oh man, here we go. The bedroom is gonna have the computer set up. It's gonna have all that, all that fun stuff. This will be the little closet area. Hmm, this is where I'll put the computer and then maybe this is where I'll put the bed. Hmm, no, wait, no, not necessarily. Let's check the other rooms real quick. Wow, this, this front room here, I gotta say, is looking pretty good. It's not even properly colored yet, but you just wait. You walk out here. This is a nice condo so far. I gotta say, I'm liking the color scheme. I'm liking this stuff. Okay, good. So the mirror is placed properly. The bathroom's gonna look different as well. This is good. This is turning out real, real nice. Okay, so... To kind of finish off, what we should do is definitely at least put down the computer setup. <gasps> Ooh, this is a pretty nice setup here. Hmm. Yes, this will be my bedroom. Okay, I have decided. Serious desk, here we go. All right, so we're gonna place that nicely in the middle like that, and then we're gonna get out our dual monitor setup. Oh man. All right, very good, very good. So what we can do actually is if we place it like this and then put the other monitor like this as like a dual setup, oh man. So wait, how would that work? Like that? Ooh, that's not too bad. And then we could put, oh, look, look, look. We can put like a little cup because like maybe we were like drinking something earlier. Yeah, yeah. All right, and then we have a little piggy bank to put on there as well. Oh man, look at that. Okay, cool. This is awesome. And then I can go on ahead and put down my chair. There we go. We'll even look like I was like in it earlier. Bam, just like that. Ooh, nice. Okay, and then let's put our bed down. Where does the bed go? We're gonna have to put the bed very nicely somewhere. Probably just like this, just like tucked in the corner. That's not too bad. Yeah, you know, we can do that. We'll just tuck it in the corner because this is where I will sp be spending most of my time. And then we can put down the little bedside cabinet that we had there. So we had the nightstand. Here we go. This is this is what I wanted right here, just like that. I believe that's where like a nightstand would go, right? Because that's like that's just like some some shirts and clothes, and then it's right beside my bed, maybe something like that. Mm, yeah. And here, you know what? I want to actually put this glass cup right here because it's like I'm having a cup of water before I go to bed. And then we can put the glass bowl here because it's like I was eating at my computer or something like that. There we go. Not too bad, huh? Not too bad. And then we're definitely gonna, hmm, we're gonna wanna give the floor, for this room we're probably gonna want like carpet or something, so that would be pretty good. Where could the modern la lamp go? So this is kind of, this is like a much, this, this kind of lamp you would put in the main room. So this isn't really something that would go in here. I'm not too sure where we could put it though. <gasps> oh, 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 oh. This could be, oh no, 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 maybe not this one. This other room right here. Yeah, this room right here. This shall be the, wow, okay, this barely fits. That's actually not too bad. It kind of like really takes up the room. 
it's pretty good. Maybe we can, it's like whenever you first enter the room, it's right there, just like that. Bam, giant model train set. You can walk around here and uh, it's kind of in the, you know what, we'll touch the model train set later. You know, it's not really, it's not ready yet. But, however, hmm, I really wanna fix the color scheme. The colors actually don't even look that bad the way they are. Um, you know what? This is pretty good. Let's go on ahead and actually finish it off with um, putting a nice little bending chair just out here onto the patio, just like that. There we go, perfect. Ah, <sighs> this couldn't be any better, look at this. Here we are, sitting on our condo, watching over the beautiful view of the plaza, and then we also have this very, very, very nice and uh, improved condo setup. This looks very good. You know what? I would be happy to live somewhere like this. This has a nice little design here. The, the color scheme is pretty good. A couple things I feel like could use a little bit of work. Maybe a little more things on the walls and whatnot. But you know what? If you guys really, really want to see more, uh, some like epic condo design i would love to return to this and we can perfect this to its absolute fullest but i am very happy with what we got accomplished today so on that note i would so like i would like to thank you all so much for joining me for another roblox adventure i hope you enjoyed it as much as i did if you did be sure to leave a like maybe even subscribe to the channel if you'd like to see more daily roblox adventures don't forget to check out my shirt I heart cats. You can get it at DennisDaily.com or there's a link in the description. Other than that, I will see you guys in the next adventure.